Ipinde ya sikmi ngelele siko mgele mbugeli yiti la bage silapa Nengwa izi vele yo selo sbambisane ii potole si zuli 3 foot ikwele pama Uwe mbugeli uyazi jina sakula sasba saba gabo baba betu Kolos sasba sabo baba betu Uwe isi njumba baba menga bengena sichule tuwaga Kwa tuwa wii enguzo yego social media Nyizo kutuwa ma 2000 ati lo baba wene ni msaba ya ulape kagi Ni bwone bamtuma izi ula apaya enda wenza sepsugu Pasi shasha shasha Hamilton Haibo siya hamba manje na inko sama kichi megu babu wako gioze konsi panji Yeah, you go back to 2000. I have done it. Finally, you told me that. Hey, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Let's see, Lloyd Quito, Mugelu, he has got a lot of time to Quito. I go to, I come and see. I cross the alley, I don't get to go. But if you get stuck, I'll let you go. I'm too mad. 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 I'm Zali, Tonga, Uvimba wetu uya pupuma Mbukeli we ekaya chikelele Njimloge unonka nyezi kalubizi Nka nyezi bright and right Nga mina fright Ekanya ba kuzo zonki nka nyezi Masi chaye ikuma ya na mshanje Njaka manjoke mbukele kaspegei hamba pambili Lili hora Ndelega yoguti sikisho na msanja isi mwomo soguti ingabuzo biela hii ni ayo kateli skwebo sake lowo owa yungu ngameli wezwe uche kop zuma. Ngasi ngasi empo safika nogo basi zikona yungi dikona so yungi dikona so yungi dikona enyo so yungi saibona ngasi buya no basu wama nangenya usuge epi yungi saibona ngogo yungi chuma. Kule njeleke kubanzi buye njele ni na mshanji teke sento na koloni enfa kogba isanta kwa ili polisi lukan kala zolu tons e imtu ukezi skayenke. Okay, what's the time again? Good long, Kalagazi. The girl and the salary between an Ibukela, a Kaya Chigele, Kufmanega in Daba, Esbal Legleo, Imozulu, Ezemilalo, Ezum Tulo, the girl and the salary up again, Ibukeli, Levanta Send and Tanaka Kul, Sisu Shwaz in two toilets in Pim. Kuli ndelege uguti simenyazele ngu kama ngagwe huwara liskombisa ekseni nje. Isi ngu mwoma lunga na nguti owabe ngu mingameli wezo uche kubzuma uzo buise lwa yini echele. Umnyango wezo kitu nyeleli iso agwe zimilo utalule izo lepsu guguti. Isi mameze loso gwenzo komishana umnyango umakoti Samuel Tobakale kanye nungu ngosho wezo blungi iso uro la mula. Uzo mage mbukeli wa tete luwa ngoshole wakulwa ngwabe intla kweza majele u ata freeza. Mfa guguti esa tonte inyange mbili ne ntugezi ishu mnatlanu nge nga yoksha indivu mialelo wenkantolo lese kumuga esa atlonzo anjenges nge kemte tweni. Mfa guguti ke i Democratic Alliance ya sposeli ntelele Kuli njeleke ukuthi kubanzi buye 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 Olu kanka lazo luma ngele upaza mise kolu manja kwanze kwa swele ka bantu abasanu. Ama sema kunye ni bati anga pezu lukwe kule na mashuma stoba makyalo lwa pulo mteto. Ate apali sema poliseni angu lume neno kanka lazo. Olu kanka lazo lukale ngolwe sine wewe kepelile yonge nga yoko isa ntako. Iku kaze njengo kubanja kwezi tuti za yongo nge kose mtetweni. Kaba sema kunye ni base kapa. Uso telopi wa sekapa o Jordan Hill Willis uti njenge ngale enye sifumeluano ukufana kwezi tuti panzi kwa mteto we sizwe wakututa kuza kubeka. I komiti lase palamende el penya ugubako togo mvigelo mpagato sa misiwe u advocate busisiwe mkwebane. Izo upotula na mtanje umbigo walo nge ngomo eitinda umkwebane. 
Kuleli komiti la sunguluwa ngombasa wa ngonyaga u 2021 nuguzel peksi suguti. Inga ba zikona yini za tu e koto e nga hole lekteni amiso msebenzini. Sagu iskati kuleli komiti lo kulisheli njengoba kukaya kwa ba name namba 8 le e faga pagati ukunga bikona we mali yo kokela abameli bake umkwe bane. Uma nga bega leli komiti sali ukipilo owalo umbigu mvigelo mpagato samisiwe uzo bege se nigwa ii tubalo gui pendulela nga luku. Iskato kutu mkwe bane abe gule li ovisi sofi nyele lima peteluweni ngomla zi ishu minatanu kumfu mfu no nyaga. Mbukeli njenga manja ya kesi posa maeslo kesi bonu kutike simi kanja nisi mose zulu. Ay, na mta njenge ngezo manga bese ngena emo tuwe ngize msebe nzini kutawiaz. Awa safano na gama zingo kubandu. Ngati sa kalu futu mal kutu wa keposa maeslo kesi bonu kutike hamba kanja niki wisi mose zulu.
Ngosi ngokuhlala nathi ni sasibukele apha enkubeni i ya Jikelele. U Adelson de Olivia Ngunye kunye nomzoqolo Manyongo kabanye ke abaseki inkampani yobugcisa Imagolide Collectives ngonyaka ka 2019 elinye ke ilungu leqela lemizobo umzoqolo okwalitsha ntliziyo ukunye nathi kumagumbu ethu esa osasazo ehamba naye kaloku u Adelson usebenzisa ke imizobo yakhe uchaza imbali elizwekazi Afrika kunye nenkubeko Welcome to Ekaya Chikelele. Masikbuli semzo kolo nawe Adelson. Oh, thank you. Siavuya ugubala apa? When you avuya? Yo. <laughs> yes. Afne kufuya kse Ekaya Chikelele. This is Ekaya yeah. Chikelele. It's great to have you this morning. Mzo kolo, I want to start with you. Ungati msha umbe umsebenzi wako ukaza njani njenge kisa? Uh, umsebenzi si upete yo si unga ubizo kuti indlele skwazo uteta nga mabali wetu ukuthi siyimvela lapha singabantu basemzansi Afrika speaking on history yethu kunye namabali athe alitshalwa sinika i voice for abantu abanganazo i voice in history in academic spaces and as well kwindawo yembali siyithetha ngemvelo yethu politically social through society as well as the contemporary issues esikuzo Mm. And speaking of giving a voice, because we know, I mean, you work a lot with Umzo Tolo. What is your role at Marcolite Creatives? Um, so my main role was as a 50-50 collaborator yes. with him. But uh, behind the scenes, I kind of handle a lot more of the kind of the digital technologies within it. Um, he comes with the concepts um, and kind of a lot of guidance regarding that. Mm. And then I play with a lot of the AI software and digital kind of production mm. behind the scenes. Mm. Amazing. And uthe to kuthi indlela esisebenza ngayo awunokutsho umnye uqala lapha umnye uphele lapha ngoba siyaphakelana xa sisebenza from ixesha apho iqala khona i idea to apho siyenza khona na kwi research yethu uyokutsho apho sese ubumba ke be yinto eyibonakalayo abantu bazothi bakwazi uyibona bakwazi udibanisa ubukho babo kuzinto esithi sizibanike njengoba hlali. Mm. Mm. And imi zobo yako ikuleka kakhulu ekakambiseni imbali ya se Afrika. Jengo mzobo imklambe zininzi zintubu nga kila kuzo. But when I ute no, let me dig deep how basi mm. ngobani. Unga tuna bangela walonto ye ya baintoni? Dingati ilungu mtu osuka kwi corporate uh, background. Kwa tuwa kum, inile lukuti mbela hapa na mtlanji ni bingu mtu uwe mbali o kumi zobo and kum, it's a calling as opposed to just a career. So inile lukutu wa nitunye nga yunga bandu ba sekaya. Aba pansu kuti ba mbazo ba tiso ba tetelea ii omabali abo ya lakikayo. Kukuba ka ikla shi ni niti history is written by a vector which was the colonial master. Kukuba ikla shi ali tunati si zi tetelele. Ukuti kukona imvelo yetu ya lakikayo kukla shi kule colonialism ni upper date apho singakwazi angu zithethelela so ngoku sizisa lona ubukho bethu ngendlela ukuthi through art siyakwazi ukuzibonisa basi ngobani ngendlela enhle ngendlela ephambili ngendlela ephakamileyo nawa nalapho sasicinezelwe khona sikwazi uthetha apho ubunzima sabufuma nayo but ke nobuqaqambi esinabo ngoku esikubo na mm. future esiyo ukuthi nathi i future generations zibona ukuthi basivelaphi kodwa nabo bafumane intonga zabo ezokuthi siyiqine siye ngaphambi siqaqambi Mm. Mzokolo here is touching on decolonization. I know that as black people we still have a long way to go considering mm. the fact that there's still a lot of relearning and unlearning that you have to do. I mean you, you, you touch that you are in the 4IR and I believe that now we are in the four, we are heading to the fourth industrial revolution. Mm. So how are you infusing you know the cultural perspectives that you are talking about? I mean digging our history as Africans. Mm. How are you collaborating the two for and, the, our and our history? Well, a lot of the digital technologies we play with uh, and the lectures that we do um, in a lot of different institutions across South Africa is kind of playing with the ideas of how to use these technologies such as AI and uh, you know, virtual reality and all these different things to kind of make animation, filmmaking, documentary making, all of these things incredibly accessible um, for you know, not a lot of money. Um, so. Beyond that as well, um, we're kind of using it to kind of surpass the role of the technician um, within the art studios and all of that stuff and kind of bringing that to the forefront mm. of our practice. And we have to say that the new mediums of technology are also integrating what is already here 
which is the Ubu means we go seven into the internet and softwares. How do we advance the ideas that we have beyond the physical realm that Utina Singa Bazo will be seen so long as a Kavulula now with Judo? Who seven is easy in the Zokuti Abandobazu Abasimisa Ekmakai, especially at this moment in time? It internet, AR. AI, those are things that is but how advanced we've come as a society and as the world. So how do we do that from an African perspective? Using these new technologies. Hmm. And I love this combo because, I mean, it's technology, Gapa, it's indoors assemble, which is nicely integrated. I want to touch, Dogbana, I mean, a, as much as, yes, you are trying, Dogbana, and we sell a band to Embo, and you Vumbulule, is indoors assemble. The second one, I'm going to be interested in Africa, the Ashinda Risha back. I mean, in terms of reception, how is the reception, not only to Ama Africa, but now, what's uh, and from the talk, uh, in Lela, Abandoba Vuyanga, you they get excited to go to Tibana and Omsibins of Sifa of Rana Wait. Gentle Bagas, go to Basbona, Kubo, Izindo, Babe Vela, Kuz, or Tina Singa, but in out large, beyond a race, Ugo Tis Teta Namanda Abangu and Abadala. So there's been a great reception in that part. Um, obviously, this is Zamugu uh, Sebenza outside the gallery system as well. Ukuti Sikwa Zuizi Salendo Emakai, Abendwane Neba Sez Kodwane. Hence, is the importance Iyoku Um Sebenza way to is teaching, education, is to infiltrate the academic space. That's where the mind Iyapo Iyipekwa Kona. So, Ngele Lisi Sebenza Ngayo, Iyo, Iyasivu Yisa Klasibu Nabandu Be Engage Anum Sebenza Way to. Right? Yeah. I mean, I mean, he's touching on that. You are infiltrating the academic space. Yeah. And I mean, earlier on, you touched on spiritual technology. And I'm very much interested to learn about that. I mean, spiritual yeah. technology. Can you just enlighten us on that? Well, that kind of, I guess, began within the co days of COVID. Um, obviously, we were locked down and separated from one another. So we couldn't kind of collaborate and, you know, draw on the same things that we usually did together in studio. And um, we then started developing kind of programs which could draw on our style. Um, and then as time kind of progressed, we're both incredibly spiritual people. We kind of started realizing there was now another entity kind of coming through the computer, coming through the different uh, cameras and entities that we're using and AI softwares. And that's kind of where we started realizing there's almost like a spirit within the technology. Wow. Um, that kind of gifts, um, let's say like, uh, errors or chances that become or read um, almost as too good to be a coincidence. Yeah. Mm, yeah. Amazing. And we the Afumanis in Dogbana, we are tongue dogbana, u sebens and abanabacha, elo lea bali wonga, elikulu, ebo min bako, kasna we sell in dogbana yonke londo yenze kanjani and ye ye pim pembelelo, ete abana kokum sebens wako. Uh, as I said, I'm 37 and mm. my brother here, Una, 24, so we have a 12-year difference. Wow. At 30 years mm. old, I went to pursue indoor year art, but through efforts academically as much as I was already pursuing it professionally. So, the Indian Funanga, I would Sifunda, Sitis Yokufa, but more so as Uba was born, Unga, Una Bandu, Abanganan, Cookies in the exotic way, Yam, Unga, so Kasi Lasheka and Ziz in Resenzaka is incha. So, from the young generation, we are able to learn with and keep up to the times. And again, we go in the Pagamiseka, Kulu, Kwazu, Kutin, Seven Sana, and Banganani, Ukwas Nam, the Vule in Rondo, beyond up on the Fundiswa corner from my generation. And to understand that, Gomsi Business Now, as Marco Leader Collective, is to bridge the gaps the racially, um, you know, uh, gender, you, you know, uh, sexuality, class, ageism, and all of these things. Wow. And Nalendo Kutibasi, Umshop and Dumyam, the age difference, Aibali Lond, going back to spiritual technology, we come back to spirit. And that's what we are, first and foremost, before we are human. And once you tap into Gulondo, you use as Basing Gumoya, Umoya Gulumpe from Lai, Umoya Gulupilisayo, Umoya Gulona Ubumba Yonke in the Lapilizwin. So then you are able to get into a, a, a space of infinite knowledge. And then through these beings in the Tibana Pentelin, Sikwazuke Uku Pakelana, see, 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 Pakamisani, see, Selisan, Uku, Kosasizamuku. 
ukubhilda le nto kufunekile sibone umzansi Afrika omsha okwazi ukusebenzisana onothando onoxolo onemvelaphi kodwa onequnga le future eqamileyo for everyone Hmm. Hmm. And with what you are saying, I'm just picking up in Dogmana, you know, the universe, Oganyo Umdali, does this thing where it aligns you with people that align your uh, vibrations. So I can say that your vibrations are matching your highest frequency. Mm -hmm. uh, what can people expect from Imakolite I Creatives going forward? And Bantu, they want to follow you guys, they want to follow your work. They also want to tap into their spirituality and align their chakras so that they are balanced. Where do they follow you guys so first and foremost we have a show that's coming up Eka Edison Oliveira mm -hmm. uh, with a brutal Ekapa which is uh, take no change yeah, so, uh, so I have a solo residency now with brutal in Cape Town uh, it's a project space and gallery uh, artist run uh, producing a show called no change take chappies um, and then that will culminate in a solo show at world art gallery but it's curated by my brother yeah yes um, and then following that we have uh, Collaboration, collaboration with Simon and Mary, mm. um, which mm. also kind of pursues a lot of the ideas yes. we've spoken about. And which is these are hats that we've created in collaboration with wow. Ooh, Simon and Mary. We've taken e postage stamps as an archive, as a space of documenting our history, for which then we rewrite a history citate about Indle Lesi Vela Goyo Naraposia Corner. The collection will be called Letters to Azania, mm. um, which will be probably launched sometime in October. Singafumaneka kuzo zongi social media accounts or u Magolido Collective on Instagram, Facebook, na kwezinye indao. You know, I want to say this with this conversation, Dogbana, we are getting the land. Yes. <laughs> we are coming for the land. Please. Thank you so much for joining us. We wish you all the best in your journey. And I love the fact that you touched on Wuti before Ngumtu Ukala Moya. And I love this alignment. It's really great. Thank you so much for joining us. Awesome. We are honored as Ekaya Chikelele. Siabulele. Tamaku. Tamaku. Right in Bugeli Wam Abokebe Snokola Nabo Basuka Pa Emakolite Creatives. Usmal Selake, Nzulungom Sebenzi Om Se Abawenza. Yo Beshangani Sakaloko Ubu Tisa Nezin Toso Moya. Let's 
futhi sikubingelele emukeli sikwamkele ekhaya jikelele njengamanje ke singena kwa zemdlalo kuleli ihora lethu lesibili isiqalile limqhudelwano emningi ke yebhola likanobhujuziwayo njengoba namhlanje iligethathwa njengecebe ku ecebe kunawo wonke emhlabeni izoqala isizini ka 2023 2024 lokhulu ke mbukeli olibhekiwe kanti ke lapha eningizimu Afrika kuqala umqhudelwano wokuqala wendebe odlalwa amaqembu ayishaka lombili wona ke obizwa nge MTN8 ukubheka kabanzi ngalezi indaba abasamkele intatheli yezemdlalo ke msakazo nunga pansi kwe SAPC ikwe kwe zi FM upavaria sindane kama sugu upavaria siko mkele kachi kele siko kakuli nge toko za sese utoko za ilo mkudo mnanda pa msuti siko fina uzi nge kwa yazi ngati ni mbo jini uti ntanda umklobo lo veli nito za kwa ay bengzwe ile ngomu nyo mwote kasa kita uti nikisata nge marinate nge pamo kutu zbena le kwa e pavaria ea kala ke english english prima lik e kala na mslanje nge manchester city ezo bipegere nge penli e ingabe msla umpe singabona idlala kanjani Manchester City mangabe siqhathanisa nomdlalo wophela wa last week ngevikele idlule lapha ibidlala khona ne Arsenal eh asukasuki yakhulu emdlalweni opheleleko ne Arsenal eh ku Community Shield ilobi le Manchester City iye kodwa nange nawuqala ukuthi ke i Manchester City nayiqale ne Burnley zikhamba njani ngingabala nje imdlalo emhlanu ebayidlala ne Burnley Burnley edlulileko i Manchester City ithumbe yoke imdlalo leyo kanti nje yakhombisa ukuthi ke nje vele imisa si City izoba ngaphezu udlwana phezu kwe Burnley iyafika ke i Burnley bomakoti ku EPL yeke kuzababdisa ukuthi bathi bafika baqala nesiqhema se Manchester City engibo ingikutane ze EPL yazi umukhuluma nge Burnley uthi iyafika la ngicabanga inkantla ka Leil Foster ukuthi awema u Leil Foster phela ke umbukeli nawe ekhaya mungazi owalapha ungokudabu kwa lapha eningizimu Africa kanti uye kuphela umdlali ke njengamanje ogijima ku English Premier League yavela iqembu lakhe lathi qualify ukuthi lizongela lokwazi ukuthi ligadulisane namaqembu afana no Manchester City mhla umpe singamubona yini engena bayincanye yeqembu ezodlala kanye ne Manchester City nakanjani u Leil Foster umbanduli wakhe we Burnley u Vincent Company umthanda khulu Leil Foster nakanga thome ngaye umthoma umthome benchini angene ese sub kodwa nanga abika nengi imdlalo ayidlale angekho Leil Foster khumbule ukuthi Vincent Company bekade ku we captain e Manchester City bekade ku understand ka Pep Guardiola ngabe ngaba nje kuhlangana i student no no tshishere emndlalo Vincent Company qala ukuthi ke mhlambe ngaba ne upper hand phezu ku Pep Guardiola kodwana akuzuba lula sakhuluma ngayo Pep Guardiola sike sabona ukuthi last season amagoli amaningi ababa bawathole umdlalo suphela sekuthiwa nje sekuba nje umoya mhlawumbe lokho ngabe kusho ukuthi u Pep Guardiola safuneka athi ukubona athi uqinisa lapha odongeni lwa i Manchester City nakanjani uqala msi nje baloba abadlala babili ne u Ike Gundogan no Riyad Mahrez baphumile kanti ke kushukumele ukuthi bafaka abadlali ebazokubona ukuthi baba replace ngikarekile mnana bathatha u Mateo Kovacic ku Chelsea 
ngasi mjalo mshekulu no just ko lokho kuyacho ukuthi ke babonile ukuthi badinga i-replacement yabadlala abaphumileko so ukuthi ke i-EPL emdlalweni emhlanu yokugcina kuba bdisi khulu nje ke ukuphekwa ukhadiona ubonile ukuthi kumele ukuthi asitrandene i-squad ngemva ukuthi alobe abadlali ababili ama eh u-Elling Haaland bebencinga kakhulu kuyena kuzokwenzeka kanjani manje Alan Haaland sengiyamthandazisa ukuthi ke kungenzekile into ebonakala ngathi ifuna ukwenzeka ngathi ufuna ukuluza iform ufuna ukuluza i-touch nama goals eh ngoko tola ke isizini sathoma asimbone ukuthi uzokuya kanjani ukhumbule ukuthi ke ekugcineni kho abantu ukuthindeka kancane edolweni uthena kabuya ko azange saba ngo Alan Haaland esimazi ko loya i-agility yakhe leya yathoma ngathi yadropa nokuhlaba amagondelo ko ngathi yadropa ko dwana sikhumbule ukuthi uli setile i-record isizini epheleleko le he is capable ukuthi angaliphinda ngoti asetile inye record Manje ezika Pep Guardiola ngi Manchester City singalindele ukuthi mhlambe izivikelene lesicoco ngoba ngiyazi ukuthi for the past three times ibona bapethele indebe kahle kahle ngabu six times ukuba bayiluza ngaleya ngalo ya nyaka ka 2022 Mhm nakanjani eh uqala nje ngendlela inqhema zihlekite ngazo abadlali ngizokuthi mina nguzo wabdisi isizini le i Chelsea i Chelsea ihlekite khulu inabadlali abahle ebafakileko nangayo nangemva ukuthi mhlambe ilobe abadlali kodwa nange i Chelsea usayine Christopher Nkunku u Sanchez Ro Sanchez Robert u Okochuku badlala abahle khulu labo sekuthi ke asazi ukuthi Mourinho Mauricio Pochettino ombanduli we Chelsea uzokhona ukuthi abalumathise nako kodwa nake i Chelsea ne Arsenal ngiziqala ukuthi ke zibe ngizo ezoba zimbange ezikulu ze Manchester City Eh masikhuluma nge asingene ke manje siphume ku EPL esingene ku MTN8 i Chiefs izodlala ngesonto de Cape Town City kanti ke ayisibonile ukuthi ayiqalanga kahle hle ngeGL Phezulu manje singalindelana ngesonto kuze babe sikhuluke ne umlifensi ekikheza Chiefs ngicabanga ukuthi kumele ukuthi azame uba flexible nangasinjalo uzoba bangapasha ukukhula igandelelo ngala msi ukudlala ngokulingana umdlalo wokuthoma olobe wesibili bese uya uya emdlalweni we cup emdlalweni we start ne Manchester City engasi lula i Manchester City iba yimraro esichemeza ekikheza Chiefs yeke ke ekikheza Chiefs ayikadlali ukuthi nesandown sibonile ekunengi okukhamba ekumbi ngaphasi kombanduli umlifensi ke nongatholi abadlali abafaneleko a right combination ya umtseki imbethile egebini Chiefs asithembe ke sokuthi ke i cup ayifani ne league emdlalweni we cup iba is a different ball game altogether lapho ukukhumbula nama incentives abadlali badlalela ukubayaza ukuthi nasingathumba kunento ezako kiyi sibonge kakhulu umbuke lilobe ku Bavaria besixoxisana naye ke Melana nezemdlalo i English Premier League yaqala namhlanje kanti kanjalo ke ne MTN8 ngokunjalo Asi njenge ku eight olo sizo biya imva kumzuzwa na. Ngosingo kshala nati ni sasa bugele kalo ku apa eka ya chigelele kuingomanda ba yako utititi. Yemi nyaka ke emi nizi ejwe ngula umkalo wa baninzi ngobu nguwane be minwe yake wukbamba iski ngui. Aba nizi ke bambiza iku mkani kazi yoslobo lepe subambi batingu au stepza. Kodwe ke inko nipo anayo kubutri sabo mtulo. Heyo na anto emkri na kulo mtulo ikasha elite. Nyao za keke ziku ele utaka. Chengoko kubantu bake basebenza na bosinga balu la kaloku ukeli kumalo usimpiwe dana. Paka tike kwa baninzi. Sleli na yeke kumakumbi etu osu. Sasazo, masikbuli sasa kwa mkele ekaya chikelele. Yabu, thank you so much. Yey, kutiwa inyauza kwa zinotaka kutalu kushuko shalaza, ubila usoma, nchenge mvumi. And we are celebrating Women's Month. Ungati Mshambe, what is your role as a female artist in this industry? I pride myself in being one of the, you know, wall breakers. You know, I am a bass player. I'm a music director you know, one of the first few female directors and bass players in the country. And I have been doing it for, I think, over 20 years now. So the experience that I have, I, I'm at a space where I'm ready to now um, start passing on the baton, you know, to the next, but also to encourage women and also um, to take position and space of who we are as women. You know, we are powerful, we are strong, we are wise and also I think because in the music industry we it's it's male dominated but we have women as the majority 
you know, um, I think it's time that we take the roles in the music business to show that we are more than just singers. We can write, we can produce, we can direct. Oh, yes. And that is the space that I am in. And you are taking that space, yes. Jonga, Wing on Pizulu. <laughs> and you know what? When a woman stands up, you're not only standing up for yourself, but we're standing mm. for all of us all of as us. women taking up that space. Yeah. And then I'm here, I'm going to mm. take the space, I'm going to heal. Yeah. I think it's, it's the knowledge that m music heals. You know, when you play music, you get people that get healed, you get people that get encouraged. And I'm all about encouraging and, and motivating people, especially women. So for me to be standing here as a bass player, as a singer, as a music director, it's really for encouraging, especially women, to say we've got so much to offer in the music space, but all we need is to be confident and to believe in what we do. Yes, yeah. and I picked up that your emotions that yeah. you bring mm. are quite intense. Yeah. Is it personal experiences or hook and the world at large? It is what is happening in our country. We have a dilapidated uh, family structure in South Africa where we find men that leave their homes and search for work or for the gold, but they never come back home and they leave women and the children to fend for themselves. So I'm speaking as a person who's watching this scenario playing out where women now have to be the breadwinners, they have to be the fathers, they have to be the mothers, they have to be the sisters, the brothers, shoulders, you know, to cry for, for their babies. So it's, it's, it's not supposed to be like that. So the song speaks about how women are carrying such heavy load, you know, and um, it says also as a society, it's time that we look and see you know, if what we're doing is, is it the reflection of who we truly are mm. as a human race or as people or as South Africans, we, as Africans, we believe in Ubuntu. Oh, yes. So if you say to me, um, I am going to come back and take care of this issue for you mm. and you do not come back and not say anything, mm. it, it really says a lot. Oh, so wow. the song is about that. It's talking about the dilapidating structure in our family mm. and society mm. yeah and speaking of a broken families yeah. that you touched on it's really sad because yeah. all of that i mean if you experience that as a child it manifests in yeah. your adult world yes it does and i mean you are the first black woman <laughs> to be featured i mean you played with tv band with tv production at yes. the, respect the respect show, show yeah. wow that is big i mean <laughs> how was that experience and i mean or impact mm. in your music career it's, it's really solidifying who we are as women. And it's also saying to other upcoming musicians to say, I too can be that, or I can achieve that. So for me, it was just a, a um, we were, I was breaking, you know, the barrier. I was just setting the standard up to say, we deserve the spaces as well. So that is one of the things that really elevated my career. Um, I'm now more into uh, music productions and directorship. I'm directing the Basadin Music Awards mm. that, that are happening uh, on Saturday. So that is a big one for not only me, but for female musicians in our country. Wow. Mm. And I love that you are raising your voice. You are inspiring millions of women out yes. there. And I mean, the fact that Queen Gomazako also mm. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, you speak about so many issues that young yes. women are facing, yeah. you know, the issues of GBV. Mm. Why did you feel as an artist Guti, it was important for you to raise issues as in And I mean, with music being mm. the universal language, mm. what is it that you are hoping to achieve? We have to talk about things that are hurting us. You know, it doesn't help for us to um, stay with the pain and not share it with the world because also when you're releasing the pain you are setting yourself free and i think it's important also as musicians to speak about issues that will help the next person um yes i'm about for songs that are just for you know downtown chill but um most of the time we have to be real we have to be serious we have to aff um, speak about issues that affect us so it's like the song I'm going to perform next is called Retabelekai, which 
it's just as uh, where do we run to where should we run to you know it, it it's the song that really addresses the gpv that we're experiencing in high volumes in our country mm. Mm. and as women achieve power it's certain that the barriers mm. will fall. Mm. I mean, as a woman, you are taking a stand to mm. fight against all the social ills. I mean, every month, I mean, social media, and I mean, we even have a month that is dedicated mm. for us as women. The society at large, we live in a society where Women's Month should not be only about celebrating only the good, even the bad. We have to put it out to light and say these are the issues that we are dealing with. How do we tackle them? Um, yes, it's beautiful that we have a month, but we have the whole year. We do not exist in a month, we exist in a year, in every day we are there. So it's a beautiful start that the government, you know, has really uh, given to us as women to say, we are giving you a month, you know, to be able to celebrate each other, we celebrate you, but we would like that to be extended to every day because GBV is happening every day. Um, um, men leave their children every day and it affects women because you cannot leave your child. You know, and um, these are the real issues that will help us also to weave back into a great society that we are all thriving for. Because if the family structure is broken, mm. there's no way we can solve the problems that we have even in our country. Mm. Because everything starts at home. Oh wow. Yeah. Charity begins at home. So Lilonke Ikalekaya. Alstevza, thank you so much for thank joining you. us. I mean, to all the strong women like yourself, may we know them, may we be them, may we raise them. Sia ku visela si ekaya chikelele koye, siya zindokbana uzal city tata, plus we have kileni. Right in Bugeli wam loge besungo kola na yenguye u alstevza kaloko. Ey, di fuselele kilen tinilina. Tinse kilen awepeka indokbana uti woman la forever.